hello everyone and welcome to the channel today in this video i am going to explain you how to import opportunity contact roles with the data loader and here i would like to inform you that uh, we have recently launched a course specifically for the salesforce administrator and even if you are a beginner then you will easily understand the topics and the content of the course and first let me show you the course content so as you can see on the screen on the website of our channel we have posted this course and these are the specifications of this course that you will be having the lifetime access of this course and you don't need any prior admin knowledge to learn about this and we have explained the modules with the real business scenario so that it will help you in the interviews also where you will ask the questions on the basis of real-time business scenarios and also you will get the certification of completion and for the early birds there is a 50 percent discount on the course so so if you subscribe this course right now you have to pay only 99 dollars so you can see these are the course content that we have divided in the nine modules so you can see we have covered each and everything regarding the salesforce admin part so you can subscribe this course and learn a lot about the salesforce administrator part so let's move on to our topic so in salesforce opportunity contact roles are associated contacts with the opportunity that provides information on the relationships involved in closing a deal so as we know the data loader is used to perform data operations like import update delete upset and export the data and it also simplifies the data import and export tasks and has the capability of handling ocr data with data accuracy so we can also create these opportunity contact roles manually from the opportunity tab but it will take a lot of time when you have to create multiple contact roles for the multiple opportunity in that case you can use the data loader to save your time so let's move ahead and see the process of importing opportunity contact roles via the data loader so in order to import the opportunity contact roles we need to prepare a csv file and here we have entered the columns contact id opportunity id role and is primary status so to get the contact id i will open the data loader and here i will run an export operation and in this step we have to select the data object contacts and select the location for the extract file and then click on the next button and here we have to select the query fields regarding which we have to import the data so here in this scenario the most important field for us is id so we will select id and i will also select the name field for the reference so after selecting the fields id and name i will click on this finish button so now we can see that uh, the data is extracted in a csv file and from here we can get the ids of the contact for which we have to assign the roles and the opportunities so i will select these contacts and to get the opportunity id you can again run a data export for the opportunity object For that you have to click on the export button again and here select the data object opportunity and select the extract file for opportunity and then you can select the opportunity id and opportunity name but in case you have to assign this contact to the single opportunity then what you can do is go to your salesforce console and here click on the app launcher and navigate to the opportunities tab and in the opportunities uh, select an opportunity record in which you want to assign the contact roles and after opening the opportunity record you can see this 15 digit code at the url you have to copy this code again go to the csv file and here i will paste that 15 digit code and i have kept it same for all the records because i want to assign contact roles to this single opportunity and here you have to manually enter the roles of the contacts for the specific opportunities so after entering the role we have to populate this is primary column so here we can keep one contact role as a primary and for the rest i have to enter false so now we have prepared our csv file now i will save this csv file in my system from where it can be accessed to the data loader and make sure that you save this uh, worksheet in a csv format so now i will again open the data loader and in the data loader we have to click on this insert button and after this we will log in with our credentials and in this step activate this checkbox show all salesforce object 
and select the data object opportunity contact roles and after this select the csv file that we have created right now and after selecting the csv file click on the next button and as we click on the next button the data loader will initialize the csv file and display the number of rows in the csv file and here click on the ok button to proceed and in this step we have to create the mapping between the salesforce object field names and the header column of the csv file and for that click on this button create or edit a map then in the mapping dialog window click on this button auto match field to columns so as you can see that the fields are auto matched to the column names and in case if the object names are not auto matched then you have to drag down the object fields to the column mapping and after mapping click on this ok button and then click on the next button and at last select the location for the success and error files and click on the finish button so now the data insert operation will run and after its completion we will get a message of success and errors occurs in a dialog box and here you can also view the successes so as you can see the status is showing that item is created that means we have successfully imported the object contact roles so here we will click on the ok button to close the data loader import so here we click on the ok button to close the data loader wizard and to check the contact roles in the opportunities we will again navigate to the opportunities so this is the opportunity in which we have assigned the contact roles and to view the contact roles in this opportunity we have to scroll down to the section contact roles and here you can see these are the six contacts that we have imported right now with the help of data loader so this is how we can import opportunity contact roles with the help of data loader in salesforce and i hope that you like this video then please do like share and subscribe us and do not forget to hit the bell icon so that you can get regular updates of our upcoming videos and thank you for giving your time and watching this video till last see you in the next video till then goodbye